Hello and welcome back everyone to this Captain America game on Scratch Junior. Now this game here is uh, pretty simple. It's a maze type game and the idea is to get Captain America to the shield before the Red Skull. Um, this is Captain America. Oh. Um, here you can see I've adapted the uh, basic cap there. If you do want me to shoot a video on how to do this, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, but I think it looks pretty cool. Um, also, with regards to Red Skull, I have adapted one of the characters to turn them into Red Skull. I found the, the only one that was sort of bald, um, dressed them in black and made them red. So really simple there. The actual... Um, Shield also is made from a number of circles and a couple of triangles to make the star. Um, and then you've got your normal, uh, if you've seen any of my other videos, the joypad there where we actually uh, allow us to move the character. Now let's talk through the coding. So the Captain American, if you want to screenshot that there, is um, coded to respond to the joypad. So you've got the orange, green, red and yellow letters. They respond to the orange button which is the code is there, the red button, the yellow button, um, and then finally the green button there. So once the actual button is pressed, it sends a message that then um, is received by the Captain America character and it moves up, down, left or right. Now, the um, red skull is coded to follow the pathway of the actual maze. The maze was made... Um, by getting a blank background and then just drawing a number of shapes to make the, the pathway there. A little bit of trial and error, but again, if you need a, a video from me to make a video to show you how to do that, let me know in the comments below. Um, now, the idea of the um, shield is that if it is touched, it is by Captain America, goes to this screen here, which automatically then shows Captain America using the shield as a weapon against Red Skull. However, uh, and basically the code therefore is, there's Captain America's code. Waits five, five tenths of a second, then jumps up and that's on loop. There is the um, code for the shield. This one's important here, this part, because that makes it look like it's rotating, which is really good. And then Red Skull, basically, when they're touched, they have a little bit of a wobble. Um, so that's the code for the um, shield. Red Skull is code, coded slightly differently. If Red Skull can get to the shield first, i.e. bumps into to the shield, um, or sorry, if Red Skull can execute its code, the end of it, it goes to this screen here. Now, this screen here shows Red Skull... Um, using the shield to attack Captain America is essentially the reverse of the other one. So the code for um, the Captain America is like the Red Skull in the last one, where basically as soon as they're touched by the um, shield, it wobbles. Red Skull's code is like this. So it basically um, just waits five tenths of a second and jumps up and down. And the code for the shield is the same as the last one, where basically it rotates and goes towards the... Um, Captain America character. Okay, so let's go through this again. Reset. So full screen, green to start. Off I go. I'm using the buttons there on the joypad to move Captain America around. Captain America gets the shield first, then attacks um, Red Skull. Now let's restart again, but this time we're going to let Red Skull get there. So I'm going to go a bit slow. And let Red Skull get there. Here he comes. He touches the... Uh, he ends where he essentially executes his code. And then the end screen is where he's using the Amer Captain America shield to attack Captain America. Okay. Hope you enjoyed that. Any questions, please let me know in the uh, comments. Have fun making it. See you next time. Bye.